Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell, Olympic debutante. Candice McLeod and her Jamaican teammate Stephanie Ann McPherson have booked their spots in Friday's final of the women's 400 meters at the Olympics in Tokyo, Japan. McLeod clocked a personal best 49.51 seconds for second in her semifinal. McPherson also clocked a PB 49.34 seconds to win her semis. Back home, the police had to intervene to break up a fight among two women along Maxfield Avenue in St. Andrew today. Why? Why? Both women received injuries and were arrested. In Manchester, the taxi operator caught on video bludgeoning another in a dispute over a passenger has been remanded until September 6. 44-year-old Nuckland Scott, who is charged with attempted murder, has also been ordered to undergo a psychiatric evaluation. In Cuba, officials are now converting hotels into hospitals as COVID cases continue to surge. Instead of tourists, the Hotel Ciego de Avila will hold up to 240 low-risk pediatric patients, while the Las Canas Motel will have 53 beds for pregnant women with the coronavirus. Rihanna is now officially a billionaire and the wealthiest female musician in the world. According to Forbes, the pop star is worth 1.7 billion US dollars, with a huge portion of her wealth coming from her Fenty Beauty cosmetic company. In your currency trading today, it was costing $155.28 for one US dollar, the British pound sterling for $216.16, and the Canadian dollar for $123.83. In your weather forecast, Thursday morning will see showers across sections of southern parishes. In the afternoon, there will be isolated showers and thunderstorms across western parishes. It will be windy across the southern parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.